Because, okay, so we can do multiple things. Oh, okay, first of all, a new Valorant cinematic was released a few minutes ago. That came out a few minutes ago. Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, where's my mother? Blap. Okay, so. New Valorant cinematic. I, I want to watch that. It's the... Episode 4. Is it a wide... It's a, it's a wide video. I hate... I can't fit this on my screen. Riot. <laughs> Why do you make wide videos? I can't. If I do full... I, okay, hold on. I have to do full screen. And then I have to, like, squeeze it in? Riot. Don't do this to me. Warm up. Episode 4. Okay, I want to watch this. Oh, there should be five. Yeah, boom! You line them up, I burn them down. <laughs> really, I could do this all day. Congratulations. You will have defeated a target practice. I love KO. <laughs> KO is my favorite. Target practice? KO, are you shading the king? Killjoy, the friend outfit. You have the same score as the rest of us. How about a game where the bot shoots back? I'll bring the fire in any game you want. <clears throat> Please, be my guest. Okay, any other game? <laughs> Let's dance. Yeah. All right. Say hello to Maxbot. Perfect blend of tactics and firepower. Now you can train against, uh, well, you. I love the new outfit. You got this pretty wide. So what is this teasing though? For you, I buy these by the dozen. Out of my way, your majesty. Yeah. I love Kao. Kao is my favorite. It's Kao and Brimstone. Is this the oh, if it, he makes me so proud? If it's teasing makes PVE, so I'm gonna rich. lose it. Oh, like a boss fight? Should have picked this game. <laughs> Winning requires sacrifice. Not really your style. Ah, uh, Cypher is gonna get it right. Come on, Cypher. Hey, fam. Let's go again. That bot owes me a coat. Oh, is it gonna be the different outfit without the coat? My turn. Main so like forge, baby. when I played right. What the all right. Playtime's over. Ready up! Team Forge? Really? What? Fire and steel. <sighs> Come on! Hey, what wait, wait, wait. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, <you're quick. sighs> How about firewire? Robo squad? Now what is this teasing though? The Swagger Express. <laughs> No. Ah. 
You know what? This really. They left without him, right? <laughs> that soundtrack is so cool. That soundtrack is so cool. So, I really want PvE mode now. I want a boss. I just want like a boss rush. You don't need like super. Actually, I, I guess you do. Give me a training room, so you don't have to spend a lot of money on environment uh, on on environment artists. Give me a give me give me a room, training room where it's just blocks. And you have a boss fight where it's just one one bot in the middle, clever AI. You have to use your uh, agent mechanics to defeat them. That would be so cool! Give me adventure mode! But it's in one room, so it's not expensive to make! Oh, I really want this now. I really want this now. Because it wouldn't be expensive to make if you if you just make one room. Although from an engineering side, making like clever AI for it, that would be, that would be a challenge. Exactly, it would be a world building thing. You're gonna play the long run. Like, you know, or, or the long game, rather. That would be so cool! Uh, exactly, exactly. You because right now, you have Easter eggs around the maps. You could, They could jam in Easter eggs hey, into Necrit, this. cool thing. Riot Brazil occasionally voices lore stories as audio dramas. They I've recently one, yeah. dubbed the Leona and Diana story, and it was really amazing. Uh, I've seen, I've seen, I think they also did uh, Viego. Because during the ruination, I remember someone someone sent it to me. I think they did Viego too. I remember that. And I know, I know, I know that they are doing that. Which is super cool. Uh, but yeah. Now, there has been some talking about uh, potential alternative outfits for agents. And you know, Killjoy, Killjoy has a totally different one here. <laughs> I love little little Pepega there, I guess, you know. <laughs> uh but So okay, so Killjoy has an alternative outfit here. Ray's isn't Ray's the same but she doesn't have the the coat? I don't know, hold on. What, what? Ray's is she... No, she is actually different. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, 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 actually. That's the shirt she has under the armor. Look, if I if I pull out this. She has like a piece of armor. And then she has the yellow shirt uh, underneath it. This is, this is the yellow shirt underneath it. So technically... Oh, she has grenade slippers though. I did not... Hold on, is there a better shot of that? She has grenade slippers, which is amazing. Hold on. It's gotta be a better shot. There, look, hold on. Oh, there he was. Oh, look at that. <laughs> okay, that's clever. Oh, that's clever. But, um... I think this might be teasing, uh... This might be teasing... Alternative outfits as well. Because that's, that's kind of what people have been talking about. Mm, I have not. I I am not keeping up with all the all the Easter eggs in the training arenas and stuff. Is there one? Is there a new one for Neon? I don't know because I, they are constantly uh, changing stuff, and I'm I'm awful with Valorant lore now. I just you know I'm keeping up with so many things. Valorant lore is beyond me a bit. Oh yeah, Neon and Zeri. <laughs> neon being Zeri. Hmm. Yeah, it it makes sense why they don't want to add skins into the game. It absolutely makes sense. It's because Valorant is a game of precision, and so when an agent comes on stage, on stage, um, you need to immediately recognize who they are. You need to. Like this game is based on that. So. When a Cypher comes in and Cypher doesn't have his hat, that's an issue. You need to know that Cypher, for example. 
So that's why skins wouldn't make sense. But alternative outfits in this way make sense because when because most of the time a player is aiming at the head of the agent. So if you still see if you still see Killjoy with the same beanie, she still has the same shape. She, you know that's still Killjoy, and you can change her outfit a little bit. You can't go, you know, you can't go too much with that. But skins can be used in Valorant, but it has to be extremely limited. And I, it, it, it would be so limited, I don't think they would be actually selling them. I mean, yeah, Killjoy's beanie is different, but it's still yellow with the little, with the little purple thingy on it. So, how much different is it actually? Because the shape and color is exactly the same. Killjoy beanie. No, it's not. Damn it, I was wrong. Okay, so this is the clever I. <laughs> So this is actually the clever design. I was so wrong. So this is actually the clever design of the alternative outfit because the beanie actually has the color of like the entirety of Killjoy, but the beanie is green. With she still has has a shape on the on the beanie, which is this thing here. But the colors are actually all right. Those are the jacket. Ah, see, that's why this would work as an alternative outfit. I wouldn't be even. I wouldn't be able to tell the difference. Uh, and Crayfax, thank you for the prime. I really do appreciate it. But yeah, that was that was a really awesome cinematic. And now I want like a training bot challenge, where the bots actually fight back.